Hello friends, this is Santosh on your favorite channel TDCH, the digital chapters.com. I am Santosh here explaining new things on this channel every day. In this video today, we are going to discuss about how to use Zoom app on Android phone. In this video, you are going to understand all details and steps and tricks that can be helpful for you to use Zoom application on your Android phone. You can join meeting anywhere with your application if you have downloaded the Zoom application in your phone. How to download this? This is very easy. Once you go on Android phone Play Store, you can see that. After downloading this, you will see this type of option. And I will show you that how you can create new meeting, schedule a meeting, join a meeting or share your screen. Using mobile, you don't need to go on any desktop or laptop to join a Zoom meeting. In Zoom meeting, you will understand from anywhere you can understand what's going on and you can even schedule meetings with your team. Or colleagues so let's begin so what is zoom meeting you must have uh, understood it earlier already in the view zoom application is a meeting application for different type of businesses from small to big businesses it is easy to communicate with your team members and from anywhere across the world you can join and it is like you are talking to your friends or team closely or lively so now let's go on google play store so now i am on zoom cloud meeting application i have gone on google play store i saw zoom meeting application here i have already downloaded this so it is being shown in this way this is application for zoom you can do multiple meetings in with your friends, colleagues, or staff, or any teammate. So this is the internal panel of Zoom application on Android phones. I have downloaded this on Android phone, so keep this in mind. These all are functions here. You can see the down, meet and chat. Here is the meet and chat. This is the meeting option. This is the contact options. This is setting. So let's go with setting. This is my account. It's a basic application, basic pack. They have uh, multiple packages for this. You can put your profile this way. This is my meeting ID, PMI, default call, user type, finger, all this. You can do a general setting here. This is all contacts in my phone number. You can create channels here. I'll show it later. So let's come on meeting. This is start a meeting. So when you start a meeting, let's start a meeting. This. So for starting a meeting, you can send invitation. Let's first come to the invitation. I would like to uh, guide you with that. I'm coming back. So when you clicked on meeting, you will see a start, send invitation, edit. So what you can edit, let's click on it. You can edit this meeting password. You can set from here any password. Suppose I said TDCH22. This is my password I have set. And this is the meeting ID. You can note this. This is Zoom meeting ID. So now this is saved. So generally you can send this to anyone or if you want to send a link directly for Zoom application, you just click on send invitation tab, click here and you can send invitation directly to your friend, colleague meeting uh, with your friends and uh, team. Suppose I am sending Gmail to someone with this, this is my ID. This has captured automatically all details on zoom you just you just need to send the information suppose i am sending to the same id 
I'll send in this way. So the invitation has gone now. Now let's come to the meeting. I'm joining this by my different computer. I have already sent the uh, invitation. So until I start this meeting, nobody will be able to join because I created this. So let's start from here. I have put a start. So now I have already invited one person. So that person will So we have seen this, this was the option meet and chat, this was used in uh, communication, this was the meeting, we have done this, contacts we have seen, now go on the top, four options here you were seeing, share screen is easy like I was uh, explaining in that point, this was the meeting ID, you can share the key meeting ID, enter sharing key or meeting ID to share to a zoom room this is when someone created a zoom you can schedule a meeting here suppose i have a tdch meeting the digital chapters so i have scheduled this meeting repeat never you can set your password meeting password is this host video on it's up to you participants video on or not you can enable or disable you can see advanced option also allow join before host automatically record meeting you can record your meeting anytime so these are the settings done inside i can save this so the meeting is saved you have to allow all this so the meeting is allowed now so the same like i have inviting myself by this so the now meeting is a start when five o'clock it will start add to calendar add to invitee or delete meeting so this will be up to us let's delete it because someone will be joining it so when uh, sh schedule i have explained it to you join meeting join meeting is like someone has created a meeting and you want to join this so meeting id you need to put here name you can put your video off and on it's up to you the new video meeting so you can start directly from here it takes no time just you need to click on it and your video video meeting will start automatically it takes only three Thanks for watching this.